hey guys welcome back to the cold rack 7 training in this lecture we'll talk about uh, interactive uh, I mean interactive fill tool and also about smart fill tool so basically this is the last lecture of this section about understanding these tools cold rack tools so first of all I will add a rectangle we'll draw a rectangle here we'll add a color so whenever you create a rectangle in cold draw you can add a color from here on this color box but you can add only one single color if you want to add multiple colors or different style of color then you can use this option interactive fill tool just click it and draw color from the center or anywhere now you can see the default color was blue and it has added another color which is basically this one white one so you can select that color from here I mean like if you want to add red color or any other color you want you can it's really simple you can directly just click this you know this small option here just click it you can add the transparency from here and you can select the color from here and if you want to change the style of this uh, color or this whole I mean gradient then you can use these options here above you can see click it it will be like this uh, and if you use this style you can use the diamond style and again you can change the color from here like if you want to add this one so it actually differentiate this here like this you can also add some uh, kind of patterns and also you can use patterns you can use this text structures I mean textures just you will have to wait because it will be searching for them the cold draw itself anyways basic work of this tool is to add colors uh, I mean multiple colors to your I mean to your this object and you can create and add colors from this area And the next thing that uh, we have here, I mean this one, the smart fill, that will do something like if you have some boxes or some rectangles and you click this option, the last one, smart fill, so you can select any color from here and then can simply add that color to multiple uh, rectangles or multiple objects, this you need to click them and it will fill the color automatically so these two tools the first the, uh, the first one interactive tool will add multiple color I mean different style of color for example like this like this and if you select this or uh, this one you can add this you can add here and you can add say here and simply you can change the color if you want for example you have to click this option you can change the color to anything you like and the next one is for auto filling the color which is selected here you can put that to any object you want and you can also select the border color from here and the size of the border from here these are very simple tools uh, we will be using in our projects but I just wanted to give you a little bit short in, uh, introduction about these two, two tools so I have told you all of the tools I mean the important tools in this list of tools in Coldra X7 so now the next step is to create some really simple uh, logos and projects in this Coldra so after that we will move to discuss the menus and then in the at the end section we will 
work on advanced projects something like uh, business card designing visiting card designing brochures and pinaplex etc so stay tuned